Hey guys, and welcome back to more Pokemon Gaia. Um, yeah, last time we finally got past the uh, ending point of our first run. So now we are in this uh, snowy city whose name I never even bothered to learn. Um, let's see. Yep, Frostbite Cave, uh-huh. This is Windmist City. So we have a couple of encounters to do, and we have a gym to do, and we have all these townspeople to talk to. So we'll just uh, jump right in. Oh, um, did a little bit of off-stream grinding. We got everybody up to level 25 or better. Um, this is what we have right now. Unfortunately, old SB here is just woefully inadequate uh, as far as attack goes for the entire team. She's just bad. You did survive, don't worry. You are still uh, in tip-top fighting shape and you will be getting a lot of play in the upcoming uh, gym because I believe we have a fire type gym coming up. Oh, I've never seen you before. It's not often we see new faces around here, especially with so few clothes on. Rude. Where would I want? Being indoors with a warm mug of cocoa. Is there a better feeling on a cold day like today? I mean, if it were not cold, that would be preferable. Woo, fire. The moo moo milk they serve here is nutritious and delicious. When my Snowver is sent out in battle, it summons a hailstorm. Yeah, we know. No, it's not impressive. Hello. Nick next door. You buy, yes. Okay. I don't know that I need any of this. I guess that's a cheaper um, super potion. Big summer blowout! Woohoo! Welcome to Wind Miss City's Nick Knack store. Would you like a bottle of our homebrewed secret potion? I am intrigued, little child. What do you. What do I gain with said secret potion? It can heal many Pokemon at once, okay? Interesting. You never know what dangers are out in the wild. Chansey here keeps my Pokemon and I safe. No. Chansey here keeps my Pokemon and me safe. Come on, people. Do you ever get the urge to see a certain type of Pokemon? Me? I've got that Slowpoke itch. <laughs> Sounds like a... Uh... Venereal disease. If you show me one, I can give you a reward. Mm. I don't know if I will be doing that. Wow, the secret potion they sell here really packs a punch. It healed my chronically ill Pokemon right away. Okay, so, miracle drug. Also seems to confirm that Pokemon can get cancer, so that's nice. Way to go, Pokemon world, for being just as bad as the real world. Regice has slept dormant in Frostbite Cave for generations. Heard rumors that the new elders want to awaken it. It would no it would be no trivial task though. The deep sleep Regice is under would take a long time to disrupt. Can't just like get next to it and scream. Did you know? Some moves are physical, while others can be special. Thanks for telling me that going into the third gym. I tried to take on Nina, but my grandpa said I shouldn't use my ice type Pokemon. Yeah, probably not. Listen to your elders, just not your new elders, because they're scary and different. Brr, it's freezing out here. I want a red scarf. That's nice. I'm a fitness freak, so when I heard Snorlax can have thick fat, I rushed out and bought an ability pill immediately. In my haste, I forgot my Snorlax's ability has always been immunity. Crisis averted, I suppose, but I don't want, or I don't need the ability pill. You can have it instead. 
I often give things out to people who come into my house unexpected. Nina's Pokemon are helpful when there's a buildup of snow. That's the benefit of having a fire type trainer living in your city. Alright, one more house here. This one has a sign. Oh, this is a lumberjack guild. This firewood is perfect for kindling. This firewood's perfect for bonfires. I think that I saw that monster while I was at Windmist Summit. Ooh, monster. I'm a traveling merchant. I get to travel the world. I'm negotiating lumber sales for the farm at Loamus Town at the moment. Expert lumberjacks like myself rack up a surplus pretty fast. You can take some of our spare charcoal. It's on the house. Alright. I feel like I had... I picked up charcoal already. I did. It was from the, uh, the stump fairy on the other side of the mountain. Being a lumberjack takes all you've got. You need to show strength, willpower, and determination. Business has been slow as of late. You see, everyone is afraid of going to Windmist Summit. Apparently, there's some monster rampaging near the woods. Whatever. I'm not scared, though. And that is actually where we will be going first. So we can go north or east. Lady? It's so cold. Can we have a battle to warm me up? Sure. Let's do this. Explorer Abby. Nah, drum roll does not care. Drum roll does not care about much. Just don't like karate chop him. That was Bubble Beam. That was not Brian. That was Bubble Beam. Gross. You know, lady, if you just kept this thing in its Pokeball, it wouldn't be snowing all the time. couldn't because regular water does not have bubbles in it. Yikes, I didn't expect it to be so cold up here. I feel like I can see all of Orbitus from up here. It's kind of dizzying. I already picked up the items down there. Okay. We have been over the fact that I need carbonated water more than anything else. Or rather, carbonation in general and sparkling water is just the least worst way of satisfying that need for my body. It's like how fried chicken isn't about the chicken. It's about the sauce or the spices that you put on the fried chicken. All right, let's see what we get here. No whammies. Okay. Okay, I can do Teddy Ursa. I feel like it evolves really late, but... This could, uh, easily replace SB. What can I hit this thing with? Can't hit it with Nightshade. Yeah, I guess I can hit it with, uh, SB. Because... She does not hit very hard. Especially not now. Oh, uh, special defense. Yeah, I would imagine. It seems like it would have to be, uh... That'll work. I think I bought some great balls. Yes. Nice. 
don't know why it's on the same page as Delibird. Little Bear Pokemon. Before food becomes scarce in wintertime, its habit is to hoard food in many hidden locations. We sure will nickname it. This is... let's see... any name suggestions from chat? Thumbum. I like... I like trains better. It's nice to have some traditional names on the team every once in a while. Alrighty. Um... Let's just go see what's in the other route, and then we'll decide how we want to go forward. Aww. It's adorbital. Hiccups. Other bear. Mm-hmm. Yep. Let's make this take as long as possible, thank you. I fixed it. So what's frustrating is we just had that trainer fight here, and she had two level 21s, and I'm sure the gym is going to throw like level 28s at us. Because... leveling. Let's see here. Sassy. Okay, speed down isn't bad. Is pick up the normal ability for this family? That doesn't seem right. Whatever. Definitely could be worse. I mean, even with a D plus attack at level 18, it's still almost as high, if not as high, as SBs, so that could be a, a swap-in option. Pickup or Quick Feet? Ugh, gosh. Quick Feet just seems like so bad. Yeah, Honey Gather was what I was thinking it was going to be. Alright, Edomist Heights. Thunder Wave. Neat. No whammies. Hey, we get to kill this thing and move on with our life. Or run away from it. Oh, nice. 30's not bad. I done got whammies. We done got whammied. <laughs> Womp. Big ol' womp. <laughs> Is there cool stuff here? No way to remember. That's true. Potion fodder. Oh, um, no, we can't use items in battle. That's one of the rules. So, potion fodder is not really a thing. The Spot Panda Pokemon. No two spinda are said to have identical patterns. It confuses foes with its stumbling motions. I think we all know. <laughs> no, so there is the, uh... <laughs> I will not be naming it that. Um, <laughs> there is the strategy of bringing something you expect to die in so that you have a free switch since we're battling on set. But, yeah, I, I try to avoid that. Alright. We'll go look. It's... 
possible and within the realms of a cruel cosmic joke that Whammy has good stats. No, it doesn't have good stats. Those are bad stats. <laughs> no, that's that's bad news. I think, so what we'll do, I think, we'll move Teddy into the party and give him the uh, XP share while we explore these two routes and see where they go. Uh, I also organized my items like manually because I have a problem and I need I need these to be in in order that makes sense. All right. Um, let's go north. Let's go see what this monster is about. Not interested. Can't go that way. Climb high enough and you'll reach Apex Temple. Spoilers, it doesn't snow there because it's higher than the clouds are. Other oh, spoilers. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, right into that one. Rake on the ground, into my face. I'm not interested in fighting these things. I am interested in this conspicuous bear spot. Like, why not just put the item ball there? Ooh. Could have had a Sneasel. It probably would have been bad, just like it was in um, Black and White 2. <laughs> you're, just, uh, you're just on fire today with those uh, snappy comments. Oh, that feels bad. I sure didn't. You didn't see me there, did you? I got tricked. Kindler Millen. With his fire horse. Haha. -ha. stuff. Bad level up. Okay. I can handle that. Super fast shockwave. So I guess we should be trying to get some levels on drain since uh, we're coming up on fire. I'm trying to think of like what. There's not. There's no such thing as a fire electric. So I don't think we have to worry too much about drain getting whomped or like a fire grass. I saw a bunch of dudes wearing black go up the mountain. I think they might be headed to Apex Temple. Okay. Like a block of ice, I shall shatter you into a million pieces. Please don't have a timber. Any other fighting type, please. Any other fighting type. Okay. Acceptable. Well, none of this really does anything. Yeah, Heat Rotom's not a thing. I don't consider Rotom to be a real Pokemon. 
especially not after being subjected to it in Sun and Moon. Freaking stupid Grotum decks, nonsense, garbage. Ugh. Ugh. Just be my map. Be my map and shut up. Ding. Take that, Davina. Now I have to heal because your stupid flying bird hurt my boy. It was used. Not consumed, used on. Just showered in. It's a big patch of grass. Wait, that's not what I want. Ooh, that's an interesting TM. Do we have anybody that can learn that? Not that it's something we want to use on this upcoming gym, but... Hmm. Interesting. I like Drain's moveset right now, though. What's Juice have? Yeah. We've got Hidden Power Ghost. Oh, we don't need Headbutt. Yeah, we can get rid of Headbutt. He's not fast enough to get the flinch anyway. <laughs> Boink! Always funny. Just like Birdcatcher faces. All right, now we're gonna run because Bide is scary. Why does everything know Bide in this game? Item Fairy, yay. It's the experience share. Yeah, I know, but not having to switch battle. As an explorer, I love finding Pokemon from different habitats. Okay. Conspicuous flower. Ah, my nose won't stop dribbling and it's making me mad. I'm gonna take my anger out on you. Okay, that's fair. I think we've all been there. Harley, with your neat arena. I definitely hate my nose running in cold weather. Would Pokemon be better or worse if there was a mastery system to the moves? Like where you could level up the moves by using them over and over again. Maybe they get, like, more accurate, more powerful, gain an extra effect based on their tier. You think? I think maybe in, like, a more constrained setting, like in Pokemon Conquest or something, where it's, uh, there's a little bit less going on, that it could be better. I'm not crying, it's just the wind hurting my eyes. Uh, see, to me, it makes it more interesting. Like, if you can, if you can have Water Gun at level seven, and then by the time you learn, you know, Bubble Beam or whatever, in the mid teens, like maybe Water Gun's not that far behind it, and its extra effect is, you know, worth worth having. Oh, this is where you got your knocked out. Nice. 
see if we can get some XP off this thing. Oh. Shrug. I wonder when we get the uh, mega stone start or mega stones start showing up. Do you have any of those? Oh, it's had stump. Roll up here or heal up. No paint dobs. Fine. That means yes. That means yes. You're not a government agency. You can't fool me. And only one of us is employed by the government anymore. Of us here in this environment. I strike from the shadows. Hiya! Ninja boy, Marcus. <laughs> See, but now it's suspicious. They are in this game. It's Donkey. You are not bound to tell the truth. That's also true. I hate this Pokemon. I hate it. And that was rude. That was a good bubble beam. <laughs> I mean, we'll get there eventually. Hopefully it's this run, maybe it's the next one that we have to continue because something stupid happens, like Frostlass in Perpetual Snow. This is a good Bellsprout Sprite. It's so happy to be here. It's a shame I have to light it on fire. It seems unnecessary, Bellsprout. It's true. It's super true. It's documented, we know. <laughs> the shadows I go. And there's also a lot of stupid things in the world. So. Well, this is annoying. I can either use my last antidote and have to re-sort it, or I can use a full heal. I'm going to use a full heal so I don't have to re-sort my inventory. Priorities. Yeah. Gotta. Yeah, we'll keep going. I'll heal the the damage off. It's not like we don't have money to buy more. I also live in perpetual fear of um, like rival ambushes or anything where you're just walking along and they're like da 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 da, and you're like, oh jeez. And it's crazy how like. You take that for granted, playing any game that you've played before, you're like, oh yeah, this is red and blue, you know, you're gonna fight your rival on the Nugget Bridge before you fight Misty. The first time that happens, it's a disaster and your rival mops the floor with you. My Pokemon are really rare, check it out. Oh, we found you. Brandon with the Panseer. Sec oh god, yeah, that one's horrible in Azalea Town. That one's absolutely brutal. And then, like, you can do it before you fight the gym, too, if you get too close to the forest, and he just destroys you. <laughs> Neat. That was rude. 
Yeah. You're dead now. Jerk. Good level up. Take that, Brandon. No. How? Aha! Almost ran off the edge here. Another Hyper Potion. Hoot hoot. Alright, let's see what's up here. A revive. That's just money. It's a long route. Anything over here? Another freaking fighting type. Remember when fighting types were kind of like the joke of the entire game in Gen 1? Whoa, kid, you can't go past here. That monster will tear you to shreds. But I've been told on good authority that the monster is within me. My Pokemon and I love aiming for new heights. Our next obstacle is defeating you. Staravia. <laughs> the uh, critically panned hit movie. Although it seems like it's getting better user reviews or uh, like people reviews than critics. But not from you. You seem to be quite anti Tomorrow War. But I guess we shouldn't be surprised that this is what happens to you when you have a day off that you weren't expecting. Well, I mean, a comparison to Starship Troopers isn't the worst thing in the world. But I take the meaning. Swellow scares me. Even at 52. I can put drum roll in. I love leftovers. Leftovers would be very good for drum roll. Everything that I saw see, um, was saying that like it could have ended 40 minutes early, which, as someone who is anti-movies being longer than two hours, is a big knock against it. I appreciate this man's team, or this lady's team, but it ain't gonna work. Oh, I see Twister did not get the uh, base power update that Rock Smash and Cut did. We failed. Yeah, you did. Yay. Boo. So here we are, Mount Ignis. I hope we don't fight. Okay, thank you. You look beat. Let me heal your Pokemon. Yay. The temple should be at the top. Hopefully there are some answers we're looking for. Or something like that. I'll race you there. We do love jump cuts. Ignis Roost. I want that. But we should, I feel like we should probably be getting Rock Climb pretty soon at this rate. Oh! A ball toy. Please don't explode while I try to catch you. Uh, 
This should be safe. It's ground psychic. Yeah. Please don't explode. Please don't. Claydol could be interesting. I kind of I'm starting to worry about our exposure to psychic types though. No, don't don't speak these things into existence. I don't need that kind of karma in my life. He was a new elder all along. Gasp. The clay doll Pokemon. It was discovered in ancient ruins. While moving, it constantly spins. It stands on one foot even when asleep. No, that's Hoot Hoot. This thing does not have feet. Right? This thing can't have feet. It just has a nub. It has a foot nub. I don't like the implication that it has another foot that it's hiding from me. <laughs> um, this is lefty. I didn't even know there were Pokemon here. Neat. Uh, I guess let's talk to this guy. Another kid? I'll take you down. Did you just let Tomkin through? Or we just not? Okay. A Zatu. Alright, well, they're throwing fully evolved Pokemon at us, so... Don't love that. Don't love that. Good stuff. Yeah. I'm hoping I'm not going to regret splitting the experience that we're getting here. Trying to get Teddy up, but it's just so much faster to do this. I mean, I don't because I never get to play D&D. I always just have to deal with the consequences of you dumb idiots splitting the party. And ignoring 80% of the stuff that I prepare. Yeah, but you also didn't not split the party or stop it from happening. Which is just culpability by association. <laughs> no, Teddy, you can't learn Sweet Scent. Did you? I do not recall. It's been over two years since we played the game. Because the world just stopped for a year. Oh, good job. You just checked. Lady! Can I help? This is crazy. Who are these guys? They just started attacking me. I've got this guy. You should go check the temple and find out what's happening. Oh, Spinner. Feels bad. This is the highest point in Orbitus. We're literally reaching for the skies to achieve our goal. A Yanma? I'm gonna drop rocks on that. These are the same guys. Like, they're leveling up their Pokemon as we play through the game. Because we definitely fought a guy who had a Natu and a, a Boldle, or um, a Roggenrola. 
That is cool. What a freaking concept, game freak. Idiots. I'm not looking forward to when this guy has double Yon Mega. That is going to be bad news. Unless it just keeps using Sonic Boom, and then we're good. Nice. Level 28, and we're learning Fury Attack. Nope. I have a discussion about somebody's move sets. That's a long way to fall. I don't like the rate at which they're throwing hyper potions at me. What are you doing? Oh, this is where you got your goal at. Neat. Yikes, that's a long way down. Hey, where is your uniform? Nowhere. It's fine. Once we're done raiding the temple, we can awaken Regirock. Those pass. The worst. Or rather, it evolves into the worst Pokemon. Hands down. There is none worse. It crazes the surrounding area. Why do you like Probopos? What cracks in acrylic, like, in what? Where do you have acrylic with cracks in it? The only... I don't... Oh... Oh, is that like when it gets all kind of, uh, I don't know how to describe it, like where it, it just kind of like shatters up into different square bits? Or did you just have like an actual crack? Crunchy hazy. Wet and messy. Lightning Y. Look at how happy this thing is here to be here. I remember when we had a bronze ore once, and then it died. Stupid platinum. Definitely doing platinum after this. I don't know directly. Um, I don't feel like I can go back to back Nuzlocke's, but platinum is on my freaking list. Stop trying to foil our plans. No you. I won't let you in the temple. You can't stop me. I'm an 11 year old child. Can this thing explode? I feel like this thing can explode. And or have sturdy. <laughs> Don't be like that. That's fine. Faint attack might end up being better. No, eh, that wasn't bad. If 
I just don't need this thing going like magnitude 11. I guess that's probably fine. Yeah. Even with a bulldoze, we're still faster than it is. Ding. Keep working, Teddy. Oh, this guy. We don't have a grass, and it's still totally fine because SB couldn't kill this thing with a 4x razor, razor leaf. to Enoch. Okay. Do we keep healing through this? Probably. Yeah, we'll go ahead and heal through this. It's just, uh, it's a long way to go. Back to the uh, town. And for whatever good it does, we will save. Apex Temple. Do we get fights in here? Doesn't seem like it. Enoch won't be happy to see some kids snooping around our business. I'll have to take care of you. Not your business. Kabuto. Metal Claw. Oh no, that's actually a neutral hit. Fair enough. We get water taking care of one of Rock's weaknesses for it. This is going to be a stronger neutral hit. Crandidopes. You don't resist this. I remember when we had one of those, too. gonna be a champion. Ah, uh, you'll regret crossing me. It's a painting of an ancient Pokemon. Its pattern resembles a dome fossil. The engravings seem very old. The letters look like those on the ancient tablet from Arkentown. Okay. Uh. Okay. You won't pass. We fight together. Yeah, Anarith and Lilip. Is it just me or is rock grass a really obnoxious typing? Like it seems like it shouldn't be, but it's really obnoxious. Just put a drum roll in. Oh good. Suck it, Anarith. Like, you can't... You 
can't light it on fire. You can't water it. You can chop it. You can steal it. Ooh, attack boost. Drumroll don't care. Yeah, drumroll don't care. Why do you even know that? Fire. This is a collection of slow pokes if drumroll is the fastest one here. No, we failed. Give me your money. We have a uh, good old Helix Fossil next. We're making the mother of all omelets here, kid. We can't fret over every egg. That's a weird metaphor that you've got going there, man. Knock the wool. Knock the wool. Pop. Big ol' red X. It's a moo bird. Ding. Let's see, so... Um, Rock Tomb is getting low on PP. But I think we'll be okay. So we've got another boss. We just go for it. Question is, do we want to lead with Aurelia for like Thunder Wave setups, or do we just want to start with Drain and, and go from there? Can uh, can Drum Roll learn Thunder Wave? Because that is better than Confusion. Dang. Sad. I think I'm just going to lead with Drain. Whomever you are, your efforts to stop us are futile. With this artifact, I can now awaken a Reggie Rock. In short, you're too late, but do not fear. Our intentions are noble. The modern world is corrupted. We intend to cleanse it of its impurities. All will be revealed in due time. For now, I bid you farewell, child. Whoa, that was insane. Let me heal your Pokemon. My Hyper Potion. So what was all that about? I see, so you encounter them in Frostbite Cave too? If these new Elders weirdos already have Regice, then that Enoch guy is chasing Reggie Rock. We have to stop them. Maybe there are some clues in here that'll let us know where they're headed next. Let's get searching. Leaves. It's an old book. Could it be the old book that we had before? A Pokemon is painted on one page in large, broad strokes. Bold strokes. On the other page is a painting of an island. Did you find something? Yeah, this book, man, that you just looked at and walked away. That island must be where the new elders are headed. To look for Reggie Rock. We should take this book back to the Professor and see if he knows which island that is. There's a phone at the Pokemon Center in, Mist in Windmist City. Let's head there now so we can get in touch with him. Let's go! The Professor said he was just boarding the cable car, so he shouldn't be too long. Man, this kind of stuff is pretty terrifying, isn't it? I mean, if the new elders are behind these earthquakes, what more could they be capable of? We've got to promise each other that we'll do whatever we can to stop these guys, okay? Professor, you made it. 
It was a, it was rather lucky you caught me. Now what is all this kerfuffle about? I see. That is quite serious. You're sure he said he was after Reggie Rock? Yes. And this book she found confirms it. Do you know where this island is, Professor? Hmm. Nope. It's quite an old painting, so it doesn't really resemble it nowadays, but that spire unmistakably belongs to Sabulo Tower. They must be headed into the Sabu or they must be headed to Sabulo Island. That's the island the SS Wait goes to, right? Let's go to Aero City! Not so fast. I see you're adamant about taking these new elders on, and they may well be behind the quakes. However, I don't want to see either of you get harmed. You and your Pokemon should train more. In fact, I just met Nina, who is the gym leader here. She was headed to reopen her gym. You both should go and face her. I know how formidable a foe she is. If both of you can beat her, I'll be able to rest easy. Well, if you insist. I'm gonna get that badge before she does, though. I've still got some business to attend to here. Good luck. I'm sure you'll be able to get that badge. Why is the third badge where you draw the line? It's not like, no, you need to be the champion or you need to have all eight badges. And I was like, yeah, you know, you just get the third badge and you know, it's, I feel better. All right, let's uh, finish this route out. Um, try and get some more levels on Limelight. So we can just go back into Frostbite Cave here. Sad. Not a new area. Nope. Another ice puzzle. Cute little ice pig. Fossil? A Smorchum. Gross. Light it on fire. Only I get to declare when hubris has been enacted. I refuse to call that hubris. Calling something gross is not out of line. Almost. Alright, El Ruin Maniaco, what do you have? I'm a straightforward fella. Winner gets the fossil, okay? Seems fair. Oh, my knight. Chomp. But wait, there was a side effect. Good enough. F minus minus. It's all yours, buddy. A sail fossil. Hmm. Interesting. Is this one undoable right now? Oh no, we can do it this way. Doink, 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 doink. An ether. Good stuff. All right, hey, a Zubit. Is 
is dead now. Gotta be careful with Zubits though, because they know bite. Alright, revenge. Revenge! Yes, good. Now that would have been hubris if it had happened again. Go away. Seems too distracted to notice you. Don't panic. Remember your orientation lessons. You don't want to miss the Meteor Festival. Okay, can't go through there right now. We're too slow to run from a swin up. Brutal. Fine, I guess we'll just put Drain back in front. Doink. Oh. Well, I guess that's all that's here. Kind of expected there to be more to this route, but I guess not. Let's try and get one more level on Drain here since we're already so close. And then we'll see what the gym has to offer for us. Ding! Nice. Good stuff. And does this go anywhere? Nope, just an item. We'll get healed up and take on the GM. We do also have, um, we can free switch into expected fire moves with um, Limelight. Yeah, we have Flash Fire, so that'll be nice to try and remember that too. I probably won't, but I'll try. Hey! If you want to take down Nina, you need to know about her team, right? Well, she specializes in the feisty fire type. You should prepare yourself with a water type. Thanks. Here's a quick rundown on the gym. Beat a trainer, the ice melts. Get it? You'll learn pretty fast. Hector and his numble. Numel. Nerman. Dead now. Nice. Welcome to the rest of the team, Teddy. Ice cold, you overwhelmed me. You beat me, so I'll melt the pillars. Frish. You can pass now. Ooh. Trixie, Trixie. Trixie, Trixie. So the first trainer was a breeze, eh? Well, it's time to turn up the heat. Are the, are the elemental monkeys available anywhere in this game other than fighting them with trainers? Not that I want one, but kind of a weird, a weird thing to put on a trainer's team. Huh. Oh, don't be like that. Okay, good. We still get the first one off. 
Aha, it doesn't matter. I overheated. I can't believe I lost. Well, a deal's a deal. There you go, you can pass. Another would Pokemon be more interesting question. Um, what if gyms were themed instead of like type based? So, like, you couldn't just sweep a fire gym with a water type. I just don't know there are eight themes. I'm not reading this guy, sorry. I'm Nina's strongest trainer, so I won't lose to you. I just don't know there are enough themes to make that work all the way through a game. Yeah, so... Remember in like gym, or Gen 3 where you go to the normal gym and you have to go through all the rooms and it's like these all these trainers use items and you can pick like if you want to go through the X attack room or whatever. So maybe there's an item gym where you know they have bally, balanced teams but their thing is they use items like more than once in a fight. Monferno. Joke's on you, I'm not weak to that yet. Ouch. Joke's on me. It hurt anyway. You're dead. Impossible. This, this can't be happening. Ugh, you can pass. Uh, you can pass, or whatever. Alright, so it looks like it is just Gym Leader next. How many Bubble Beams do we have left? Fourteen should be plenty. Do I want to take the XP share off now? Yeah. Oh, let's see what uh, Teddy's hidden power type is. Not that he'll be a real good user of hidden power, but it's nice to know. The water type. Okay. That's not nothing. It's better than Fury Swipes. Hidden power so early in the game is amazing. That was a long one. Alright. Oop, oop, oop. No. Wait. Yay. Alrighty. What is she going to have that's going to throw a wrench in my fire plan? Or in my water plan? Sunny day? Could definitely have sunny day going on. We don't really have a counter for that. We have our own fire type move. That was not a good cat noise. That was a, I'm gonna throw up cat noise. Great. I do have Rock Tomb. Can anybody else learn that? I just really hate relying on a move that isn't 100% accurate. 95 is pretty good though. Juice? I appreciate your versatility, but um, I don't think that's going to be happening. So she's probably got a Torkoal then, unless she's actually got a Sunny Day user. Whatever. Let's get going. 
Gym 3. So, you managed to sear my gym trainers? Nice going, Hotshot. Not many could have done that. <laughs> Employee of the month. But, have you burned yourself out? Are you ready for the maelstrom of fire my Pokemon and I will bring? We burn with a fiery passion for battling. I have but one question. Does the same flame burn within you? There's only one way to find out. Pig Knight. Aww. Aww, our friend. See, that's a pretty big jump, because, like, the last trainer was, like, level 23, and she throws out a 26 on us. That's kind of annoying. Because now it's going to get to hit us twice. Oh, no, we get the Super Potion. That should kill it, then. Yeah, nice. Bruno. Sorry, Bruno. Yeah, hard to complain about that. More stats, more stats. So this guy could have Sunny Day if he gets it, gets it off. Ow. Ow. Well, now dra Drain's in the danger zone. Wow. That's not good. This way, if he paralyzes us, we'll get him back. Go away. Good crit. The crit may have mattered. Drum roll was not that strong. Nice. Eat more! It is, yeah. Priority moves are just so necessary. Don't love that. Don't love that. I don't know what it's building up to, but I don't... I don't need it. Oh, this puts us into Hidden Power Quick Attack range? What? Second item? Doesn't matter, Quick Attack. <laughs> that was wild. <laughs> oh, level 28 camera. So if we can get a, a switch in, we'll be okay. But let's just do this and see what it's going to try and do. <laughs> also, full heal fix and confusion is good. Ooh, okay. I see you. I see what you're doing. I don't know that I have a uh, good plan for that. Aurora Beam's a neutral hit, but also special. Grind it out. Limelight can't do anything against this thing. Aurelia can't do anything. Ugh. Yeah. Hopefully faint attack is more than just a tickle. Okay, that's that's a little bit more than I expected, so I'll take it. Really no, that's it's it's ground fire, not rock fire. Come on, one more just punch yourself. That's fine. 
Oh, sure, sure. I think Drumroll has this. Unless something insane happens. A drum roll, a please. Dang, double crits? Yay. And when you when you have HP and defenses like that, you don't really need to hit that hard. <laughs> what? No way this happened. Here, take the Ember Badge. We... I can't believe I actually lost. Take this, too. TM43 is Flame Charge. When a Pokemon uses Flame Charge, they become cloaked in fire, and then they strike. Wahahahaha! The Adrenaline Rush boosts their speed stat, too. Isn't that great? Flame Charge is a personal favorite of mine. Thanks again for that spicy battle. Okay, bye. No. Doink. Doink, doink, doink. Nice. Ah. Have you got Nina's badge already? Impressive. I finally got the machine part I needed. That means I'll be able to revive fossil Pokemon using the machine at my home again. You and Tomkin are free to use it too, of course. Speaking of Tomkin, last I saw, he was still training his Pokemon. I gave him one of these. Here's yours. The bike voucher. Nice. You can redeem that for a bicycle in Aero City. I'm headed there right now myself. Do you want to come with me and catch the SS Wake to Sabulo? Sure. Great. Here we are. Just go to the part or the port and you will board the SS Wake. Remember, the new elders are dangerous. Keep your wits about you. I'm gonna see if there's any more useful info in that book you found at Apex Temple. I'll let Tompkin know you already left. Stay safe. So we can use our, uh, our fishing rod here to get another encounter. So, bike shop and fishing rod. Oh, we can fight the uh, inverse battle guy, too. Do you know what level his guys are going to be at? I don't... It's just always so scary. So like level 28? 28's a lot. Maybe we don't fight that thing. Is this the bike shop? No. Oh, that's a bike voucher. Okay, here you go. That piece of paper that I had was worth a million Poké Dollars. How does that place stay in business? That's not what I wanted. Register. We. Oh, we should put Aurelia in front because this thing's gonna be low leveled. Or should we save should we save our fishing rod encounters until we get better rods is the other question. Because save them? Yeah. That's probably probably the right call. All right, employee of the month. Time to shine. Thank Ahoy there, the SS Wake isn't back yet. Tell you what, let's battle to kill the time. What do you say, small fry? Rude? Full steam ahead.
Braveton. Gross. Special defense tank? No thank you. Woof, that was a crit? Okay then. We'll go do anything else. Haha. You dead man time. Well, that didn't kill much time at all. Woohoo! That was a great battle, young fry. Talk about good timing. The SS Wake has arrived. Ahoy there, do you want to set sail for Cebuo Island? Sure. All right, all aboard the SS Wake. Whee! Cebuo Island. The Isle of Potential. You look like quite a strong trainer. Are you here to take on Bell? Sure. You ever wonder what's in Cebuo Cave, and why that old man is always guarding it? Does that box have a troll in it? Or maybe a troll? Trainers flock to Cebuo Island, clamoring for the Mega Ring. Uh huh. Sure. Yeah. What and uh and uh what goes in Mega Rings? Remind me, is it, um, maybe Mega Stones? What they don't realize is that it's useless without Mega Stones. Imagine that. Have you tried looking for shards with an item finder? <laughs> Shard tutors value them highly. They'll teach Pokemon special moves in exchange. It's important to keep your Pokemon healthy. If you let them get too heavy, Grass Knot will hurt them a bunch. Here, I'll give you this TM so you don't forget. Yep, Grass Knot is a real threat against heavier Pokemon. And against 99% of all the other Pokemon, it's trash. Successor Bell rewards trainers who show promise a Mega Ring. The Keystone in a Mega Ring holds a peculiar power. Successor is a weird title. Belle is so beautiful and powerful and smart. She terrifies me. Dang it, I broke my spoon. How does that even happen? You can have it, I guess. What a weird... What a weird situation. I can't decide which Pokemon I should give a Megastone to. Probably the one that you have the Megastone for. Only those well-versed in the way of the world are permitted entry into Cebuo Cave. Leave! Fine. Didn't want to go in that cave anyway. Cebuo Tower, the secrets of Mega Evolution held within. Cebuo Cross. Do we still have cut? Nope. Okay. Well, new buddy. Or if I could get into the grass, thank you. <gasps> Yay! Bird friend. Bird friend. I think you got a uh, Swablu here too, right? Or you have one on your team. That hurt. That hurt and was not fun, thank you. Please don't. Oh, you got one earlier. Where can you get Swablu earlier? EOTM, Employee of the Month, got it. Got there, took me a second, but got there. That won't work. 
That won't work. We have reached an impasse. Can't do anything to this Pokemon without killing it. I wonder if... Like, if Swablu were introduced today, if it would be dragon flying from the very beginning. Like, uh, Noibat. It seems like it would be. Like, dragon's not the, uh, bogeyman it used to be. Got it. Cottonbird Pokemon. Constantly grooms its cotton like wings. It takes a shower to clean itself if it becomes dirty. Zay a boy. This shall be. Come on, I need a name. Help me out here. Just make the entire table shake there for a moment. This, let's see, is nope, too late. Oh, okay, good. That's fine. Having nothing is acceptable. This is hey, Steve. No, I want it, needs the exclamation mark. Thank you. So we need to... Ooh, teeth brushing times. That's important. Take care of your dogs, people. Oh, look at this. We actually have a stable of switch-ins. Ooh, Brave is good. The stats aren't great, but Brave is good. The speed's already low. This might be serviceable. The the defense is being bees is nice. Safeguard, Charming Cry, Mist, and Takedown. And we never looked at Lefty. Ooh, negative attack. Are they physical attackers? Huh. Could have sworn these were special attackers. Not that either of those stats are great for that. Well, is what it is. All right, who knows cut? Amelie, your time to shine. We couldn't put Employee of the Month away. Employee of the Month is a very Disgaea name for... Uh... Actually, I'm pretty sure I've seen that as a name in Disgaea which you still have to play. Just don't play six, because six looks like it's trash. All right. For now, I think a Steve will live in the box. But we may end up needing a flyer or something in the future, so. We've got options. For once, we have options. Ow. Yeah. Can't. Can't fly on, uh. Anything that isn't a ground ghost robot. Alright, let's see what's going on here. I'm trying to catch as many Swablu as I can find. Right now I've got 17. Just gonna keep going. Wow, level 27, huh?
juice now. That was a pretty big level jump. Is it what the A Steve was at level like, 23? And they just threw a 27 at us? But I mean, it makes sense that the rest of our team is a little under leveled given how much attention we gave to Drain coming up to that fight. Welcome to Sabula Island. Prepare to get destroyed. <laughs> I guess they're nice about it. Holy Quarrel. Nope, can't do much about that. Let's see what it does. I don't love that. That seems bad and scary. So probably a Swift Swim. Come on. Come on, Breakthrough. Yay. Nice. Vaporeon gets Swift Swim, doesn't it? That seems like a Vaporeon thing. It definitely doesn't get Rain Dish. I'll be like that. Does it not have a water move? Oh, that's special defense. I gotta switch. It's on the border. Dead. Ding. Ding. Oh, I got destroyed. A lot of wild Pokemon you'll find here love living by the water. Oh, so I guess we're getting Surf sometime soon? I guess we can only go into the uh, temple thing. Seems like if you had Swablu from a previous area that you have a much better chance of getting something neat there. We're going this way. Sabulo Tower. Hey champ, welcome to Sabulo Tower. If you can climb to the top and defeat, defeat Successor Bell, you'll get a Mega Ring. Quite the prize, no? Is this a gym? This isn't a gym, why are you here? Welcome, young one. I shall be your first challenge. Let's begin. Expert Nikolai Glamiao. This thing does not get pursuit. Great, because I bet you were probably a little more leveled up than I was, or than I am. Okay. Yeah, there's, they kind of throw you from that gym right into this, and there's not really much in between. Oh, I didn't even realize. Yeah, oh my god, no, please. Holy cow. Please get off my screen. Please get off my screen. Thank you. Yeah. Teddy Ursa has Lick at that level. Not much else. I was going to try and use Limelight, but what level is this thing? 27? 
I don't want to get like take down or something. Taken down. Whatever. Brutal. Well, that might be the end of Employee of the Month. God. Go away. I don't care. Ooh, leer into workup. That's not great. Does this thing have anything? It could have bite. I was say, could it have anything that could hit? Uh, that could hit limelight. So we've seen workup and leer. What else do you have? Take down. Interesting. That hit for a million. Nobody else can take a takedown except Limelight. But what we can do is switch to Limelight, hopefully nuke a takedown, and then maybe switch back to drum roll without drum roll without the uh, leer on us. Hit yourself. It has to no bite. There's no way this thing doesn't no bite. If you weren't kidding, man. One more time? Yes. All right, now we can quick attack it. Oh, or it could just kill itself. Yay. Saved by the confusion. You show promise. All right, so we need everybody at least at like level 28. Jeez. Why don't we get Teddy to 30 and evolve, evolve him? Let's work on that. Because having a big, dumb, normal slab of meat in our team should help a lot. Ooh, Electrike. Neat. Switch. All right, so we're gonna need the uh, XP share back. Oh, I guess we can give the uh, Twisted Spoon to um, Employee of the Month. Paralysis is annoying. Jigglepuff. I can't do anything against that. It's fairy typed. Because of course it is. We don't have anything that hits fairy. Aw, 
all skitty. Oh, this is what you got here. Nice. Neat. Also cute. Oh, nope, it's dead already. Yeah, I guess we can. Can you die? Thank you. If I see another one, I'll catch it. the fairy stuff. No, don't. There we go. Or are you going to be a jerk about this? It's going to be like that, huh? Okay. Somebody needs to be paralyzed. Pokemon. It always vacant. It is always vacantly lost in thought, but no one knows what it is thinking about. It is good at fishing with its tail. This is QR code. Was that guy here in this town, or was he in the, uh, he somewhere else? He was here, right? Ice Town, okay. Let's look at this guy that we can't use, or lady that we can't use. An S in speed on a slowpoke. Amazing. You go over here. All right, we'll do that later. I want my big bear slab. That was scary. Air cutter is high crit. Probably wouldn't have been able to stay in for a second go.
playing fast and loose here. You need to slow it down. <laughs> wow, something about it then, huh? That could be bad. I'm debating just using the freaking rare candy on it when we get to 29 because of like his attack isn't bad but we're just not getting that much XP from any one fight and not having a stab is brutal do we have any TMs we can use here frustration no where's my return shadow claw You learn flame charge? No. Oh, really? Elaborate. Oh, womp. Dude, those Swablus with their takedowns hit so hard. Ooh, we can buy Ultra Balls now? Sure. More antidotes. We need some perilous heals. Don't really care about the rest of these. Need more full heals. Okay. Come on, I want my bear before the end of the episode. Wablu are not worth much. The Electrics are what we want. sevens in general. Freaking roll... Go away! God. Yes. Please.
Okay, Slash should let us tear through the rest of this, though. Really? It's just the... Well... That's annoying. Go away. Fairy type sucks. Fairy type was a mistake. I guess it doesn't really matter if there are multiple trainers per floor, but uh, hopefully there's not too many per floor, or that's really going to be a heck of a tower. Yay. Okay, good. Yay. going on here. 99 HP and an 87 attack. Yeah, I'll take that. That's higher than anybody else is able to put out right now. That helps. orb sometime soon. Ow. Oh, because of guts. Gotcha. Alright. So, I'm gonna give Limelight the XP share. We're gonna go back in. That's fine. I think we'll lead with drum roll for the next fight. Oh, yep. Okay, next floor. For all the good that it does. Your effort has been valiant, but it ends here. Hopefully not. Okay. Can definitely try and light it on fire if we have to. Kind of precludes us from doing anything there then. One hit. Just smack yourself. Oh well, we have a quick attack. That's really annoying. Just 
stay confused. Once. That's three. You've only got two more of those stupid things. Finally. Go away. Seems like something we could switch to Limelight with. Could have like Giga Drain? Poison Powder? Sure. I know it was risky, but. We were gonna kill that thing like that. Wormadum. I know you didn't like it. Well, where? Is this thing mono bug or is it like bug grass? Can I Aurora Beam it? It's gotta be mono bug. Oh no, it's it's the grass, it changes based on what type it is, so it's the forest cloak one, so it probably is grass bug. Yeah. Alright, let's let's try juice. Okay. So its hidden power is either ghost or bug. That's not great. I guess Teddy? This is a really annoying or or dark, yeah, yeah, right. Good to know about that. Not that I can do much about it. Don't love that. Can we kill this thing in like two hits, please? Thank you, or just crit it. Thank you, Teddy. Good job, Teddy. <laughs> crit mattered. I underestimated you. Here's some money. Oh. Yep, 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 yep. He really didn't. was I don't know it was kind of like back and forth there were parts of it that were really easy but uh some of it that wasn't how many uh how many non-leader floors are there So we've got an ace trainer. So probably a second ace trainer that's a girl and it's, geez, that's a lot of floors. <laughs> Six, holy cow. When I get my mega ring, I'm gonna take on the elite four and become the Orbtus champion. 
I'm not going to let some scrub get in my way. Rude. She's in here minding my own business. Ace trainer, Atsushi. We've got one Leer on us right now with a Larvesta inbound. That's not great. Can I drop rocks on that? It is. It's so useful. Ground. Oh. Ground is a good type to have an attack. Like access to an attack of, but I don't really want a ground type on my team. Ooh, this is where you got got, isn't it? With the sunny day, and you thought with the 4x water move coming in. Or at least it, uh, it it did some damage. Let's just get uh, we'll get drum roll back back out because hidden power or yeah hidden power will let us hit this thing. Uh, it was different. Uh, well, either way, we have to outlast this sunlight. Focus energy is not great. I don't love that. Uh oh. Oh, you were trying to wall off 4x water with sunny day and it didn't work two X now yeah. all right well we should almost be out of this sunny day go oh, well there you go that'll does it mega Gyarados isn't even water isn't it like flying dark because mega types are bizarre? Water dark, okay. Bye. How did this guy get past the first two people? You cheated. Didn't need to for you, sir. tower go? Am I even near the top? A barboach. Could this be a water or a uh, rain dance team? Cool move. So glad this is in the game. thing was up to, but it's dead now.
Definitely seems like this wants to be a rain dance team. Switch to Aurelia now. Hopefully we get a uh, confusion smack. Yay. Good stuff. Because Shockwave will not kill it. Oh. Come on, Aurelia. You can do it. It's really bad. Okay. This should get it to about half, I think. Well, that's actually pretty good. We'll stay in one more time. Brutal. I'm just gonna go back to drum roll to keep the EXP like from just completely getting diluted. Go away. Nice. So this is actually a question. Do we want Hex over Nightshade right now? It's only base power 50? 65. Oh, that's actually pretty good. Yeah, I guess that is better than Nightshade. Had the opportunity to learn Will Wisp and passed on it. This definitely feels like a swift swim. Yeah, but she can't learn Thunder Wave on her own. Yeah, that does help. I hate these things so much. They hit so hard. Good. Good. Bear catch fish make go. I'll do you one better. That was, God, that wasn't even a crit. <laughs> it don't matter. It don't matter. Good stuff. I feel like I'm falling all the way down. Alright. Why do they do this? Why can't I just hold the direction that I came out of the stairs in? Or go down the stairs in? I kind of want to finish this tower tonight, but maybe we just get to the boss. Because we're already running long. Let's see. So annoying. All right. Looks looks like maybe this is the final one. Juicington, you're falling behind. 
I am the last challenge you must face before Successor Bell. Don't hold back. Teehee. Expert, a gem. With Yagumi. Don't love that. That's a level 30. Look how cute it is. not good. That's the opposite of good. Well, I guess you're sitting the rest of this out. Lol. I don't think that was a crit. We just murdered it. Okay, so that's... Dragon Rock, right? Okay. Dragon Rock. Not great. The paralysis is a real problem. I'm gonna see if Aurelia can punch it. No. Okay, that's good, that's good. Yeah, or bite at the very least. Yes, good. Yes, good. Yay, nice. Good job. Ground is a problem. Neutral hits, yeah. I'm just wondering if I should try and confuse it first. It doesn't seem like it's... It's not known for having any sort of, um, like, status effects. And Drumroll can't pass it along anyway. Yeah, let's try for Bubble Beam Neutral Hit. Unfortunately, it doesn't. It's only on um, application. All right, we have to get out of here after that. But this should put us in decent shape. Because this might be like quick attack from drum roll. Oh, or we just kill it. Good job. Good job, team. Extraordinary. Alright, let's cure that uh, poison, get everybody healed, and we will call that an episode. Alright, so I will definitely uh, try to do some grinding, I guess. Let's see, so that person had a 32 on their team. So I feel like we want everybody at the very least to 32 before we uh, fight the boss. That feels like a decent uh, benchmark. All right. 
but that will be for <laughs> that will be for Thursday. So I'll do it for tonight. Thank you for watching and participating. I'll catch y'all Thursday night. Bye-bye now.